Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show a very beautiful chess game. This is the game between Karim of Sijan and Shafarath that was played in Bad Borishofen in 1995. Bad Borishofen is a spa town in Germany known for the water cure, hydrotherapy. Karim of Sijan had the white pieces and he started with d4, black plate, e5, and we have Charlik or England, Gambit. Pawn takes pawn, knight to c6, attacking pawn, knight to f3, defending, queen to e7, and white played knight to c3. Also possible is queen to d5, and bishop to f4. Then we would have this continuation. Queen to b4, check. Bishop to d2 blocking, queen takes pawn, and knight to c3 is the best way to continue. One of the games went like this. Black captured on b2, and white played bishop to c3. And that is a mistake. Black played bishop to b4, and now white can't take queen because bishop is pinned. Queen to d2 was played. Black captured on c3. White recaptured with queen, protecting rook. If a queen takes queen, then knight takes on c3. But white missed something. He missed checkmate on c1. Let's go back to our game. In our game, knight to c3 was played. Black captured on e5. E4, C6, preventing knight to D5. If knight to F6, then bishop to G5 and planning knight to D5. So black played C6, bishop to E2, D6, and castling is sensible move. White played knight to D4 planning to push pawn to f4 and black played g5 to prevent f4. Better move was developing pieces. g5 was played, white castled kingside, h5 looks very aggressive but it leaves black behind in development. f4 attacking pawn, attacking knight, pawn takes pawn, Bishop takes on f4, knight to h6, better move was bishop to h6, knight to h6 was played, queen to d2, not attacking knight, but planning bishop to g5. Bishop to g4, and the black would like, would like to castle queenside, but there is no time. Bishop to g5, f6 is not good because bishop takes pawn, so queen to d7 was played, and we have reached critical position of the game. It is white to move. If you wish, you can pause this video and you can try to find the coolest move that white played in this position. Ready? Have you seen this? Knight to d5. If pawn takes knight, then bishop to b5 and black is losing. Knight to g8 was played in the game. Queen to a5. Threat is knight to c7 check, forking king and rook. But now, black captured on d5. Bishop to b5, knight to c6, and black was counting on this variation. If pawn takes on d5, then knight takes queen, and black is winning. That's why white played queen to a4, rook to c8, pawn takes pawn, and this is a lost position for black. But black continued with bishop to g7, 
Pontex Knight, Pontex Pawn, and Knight takes on c6. If Bishop takes, Black would sacrifice Rook. Knight takes on c6, King to f8, Knight to e5, discovered attack in this position, Black resigned. He could have continued with the, for example, Queen to e6, then you would have this knight to d7 check, and after king to e8, rook from a to e1, you can find other continuations, but black is losing in all variations. If black blocks, then so this is total disaster for black. That's why he made good decision to resign at move 20. And that was a very nice game played by White, wasn't it? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.